Who's afraid of the big bad wolf? Certainly nobody at the Wildwood Trust in Herne Bay. They're proudly showing off four grey wolf cubs who've been venturing out of their den for the first time. Well, grey wolves were hunted to extinction in the UK back in the 1700s, but the cubs' parents were brought to the Kent Park so they could breed, and the hope is that one day they could be released back into the wild here in Britain. Our environment correspondent Yvette Austin reports. A wolf in her den, but she's not alone. The camera reveals she has cubs. In all, there are four, and at three weeks old, are becoming a handful, and it's all being watched. This is where we've been monitoring the birth. It's nice and big. Is this, this yeah. is a new enclosure. This has all been rebuilt, and in here, we've got our little monitoring station. I imagine you've sat in here for a few hours. Absolutely. <laughs> Is the mum still feeding them? Yes, the she's so still, they haven't weaned. Mm -hmm. um, she'll be weaning them shortly. They'll be starting taking regurgitated fruit from the mum's mouth and she'll wean them, but they're still suckling at the moment. We're just at that point where they're starting to move around. So there's a few times in the day they'll come out and they'll play in. We've caught some fantastic footage of what they do. It's super secret, not even the other keepers knew they were born. We blocked everything off, apart from having my little security system that I set up so we could view them. And But now they're starting to venture out and even the cubs were running around in front of some of the public yesterday, so they've finally come out. The family of wolves will soon become an attraction here at Wildwood, but they'll also be closely studied, as Peter Smith would like wolves one day to be reintroduced into the wild in the UK. A wolf could actually bring back all of our threatened wildlife, wildcats, pine martens, they can all benefit because they sit at the very top of the whole ecological tree. The farmers won't like it though, will they? We're giving millions if not billions of pounds to subsidize farming in areas where it's really poor quality farmland if we're going to have a healthy environment for our children wolves will allow that healthy environment to happen it'll actually save us money from spending too much money on inefficient farming the idea is highly controversial and any release is years away but rewilding as it's known is an increasingly popular topic of debate Yvette Austin, BBC South East Today, near Canterbury.